Welcome to AnimatedArtLessons.com. My name is Jamie, and I will be your instructor. If you go down here to the bottom at the dock, you will see that Toon Boom Studio is located here. If you click on it, it will open. And if you're on the PC Windows computer, go to the Start menu on the left corner, click on it, go to All Programs, and locate the file or the title for Toon Boom, and then look for Studio. Okay? Studio is the name of this product. And so let's look over here where it says Untitled. I always just click at the end of it and then highlight it again. It might work the best that way. Okay, so now what we want to type here is Getting Started. Okay, because this is just a Getting Started tutorial. Leave this on Most Recent. Leave that at 12 frames per second. Leave that on or set that to 720 pixels by 480 pixels and it will by default be pixels don't worry about it and then select over here on create now there's other windows here you can explore those later click create As soon as you do grab this first set of tools click on the move tool or the select tool and click the grid okay click the checkerboard graph there and look for high grid at the top all right, and then put the tools back. What that did is it took the grid off of there so we can focus on a white piece of paper. I want you to notice, if you look right over here on these corners, I'm going to zoom up so you can see this much better. This is the drawing mode. This is the camera mode. This is right here. Let me see if it gives us a little tool tip. This is a side view, and this one's the top view. Okay, now you can't see it very close. Too good because I had to zoom up. So you can click on those and notice, and I'll explain this later, but now let's focus that we want to be <clears throat> on the camera mode. It's the second step right over here. So make sure you pay attention to that little spot right there. It looks like an insignificant set of tools, like it's for something more complex, and it isn't. It's very important, and you need to keep your eyes on that as you're working through Toon Boom Studio. All right, so the next thing we've We've selected the grid, we did all that, we set this on the camera mode, which by default opens up this uh, outline that you see over here. Let me just grab this tool, and I just turned it red. That is the camera, okay? So we're on that layer, that is the camera, all right? We're on camera mode, and you can draw on the camera mode, okay? So just uh, be aware of that, all right? So I'm gonna go ahead and click back over here on the layer, okay? If you're stuck, where you feel like you can't get out, make sure you click on the layer and then move back to the select tool where you can draw. Now, if I'm going too fast, please stop the video, rewind it so that you're able to do it. Okay, so let's keep going. The first thing we wanna do over here with these three windows is select color palette. And I want you to grab it and throw it down here at the bottom. Notice it turned gray. As Soon as you do that, let it go. If it didn't go inside of there, nudge it a little bit, and sure enough, there it goes. Click on the color palette, and now you've got your color selected there. And then I want you to go to the uh, bottom here. Move this little tool up to the top here, this set of tools. These are bones for animation. And what we want to do is make sure that you can see it says timeline, exposure sheet, and then function editor. What I want you to do is go to the exposure sheet and pull it out, pull that window out to here, and then grab it and throw it up here at the very top. And make sure you can get this window behind it right here, this window to turn gray. Now it popped up there, but I don't want it there. I'm gonna bring it here. I'm gonna go all the way up here. Notice I'm using the corner, the mouse, I'm bringing it up here to the very top, and I'm gonna try to pop this window on the top layers. Notice there's the divided area here. I'm gonna throw it on top of this section, not the bottom section. Okay, so let me do that. Move it up here, very good. Throw it back down, and when it does, look, the back side is gray. Let it go, it pops in there. When we do that, make sure you click on this icon right over here so you can see the thumbnails. Next thing we need to do is go back to Timeline and go down here to this little magnifying glass. If you can't see it, make sure you click on this green button here so that it pops it up and we can see it now this is one frame each of these is a frame or a cell all right so for now this is very good i'm glad you've set up toon boom notice that there's tools across the top tools here these are drawing tools these are scene planning tools and these are bone tools okay let's go ahead and stop there i'm going to put these tools back where they belong right over here in fact i'm going to keep this one up here so i don't cover this area and 
what you also need to know is that we can label layers. If you call that ball, it will actually name that layer ball right over here. So that's the first frame for ball. So if you draw a ball, let's say we draw that right there, the first frame will be there. Okay, let's continue on the next lesson.